After five years of serious deliberations, discussions and cover-up, finally the state government has revealed the contents of the HEMA committee report. Remember, it's a 235-page report which clearly points the fingers towards a male domination that was existing within the Malayalam film industry for the last few decades. Now, in this report, there were very, very serious, shocking comments that's been made. One such is the sexual advancements uh, that's been made both mentally and physically against various actresses uh, and also uh, female artists uh, by uh, male artists a number of times in the last few decades. Now, also, it says that there is a casting couch that exists in the Malayalam film industry. It also speaks about uh, the safety, the security of women artists, mainly uh, those uh, actresses, especially newcomers, who has been clearly mentioned. But shockingly, none of the names of the accused or the complainants has been uh, mentioned in this report. Now, that has been done as per the instructions uh, of the government uh, after a uh, number of artists have said that the privacy should be respected. But however, uh, Minister in charge Saji Cherian has clearly said that those uh, you know uh, people, those victims uh, can come forward, uh, raise uh, you know uh, raise a complaint in the court, and then the state government will surely support them. Various shocking allegations that no one even thought uh, would have happened is being mentioned in this report. It's not just about casting couch or uh, salary disparity, but also uh, sexual harassment, sexual advancements and other things that's been clearly mentioned uh, in this 235 page report now it needs to be seen whether the state government and the agencies will uh, look into this matter and if the victims raise these uh, issues if they are ready to reveal the identities will the government take this case forward and will the law take its course